did you go? Just throwing something away. You don't run away like that. Autism is, and that is our life. Um, our son Joshua is 12 years old. He has high functioning autism. Is it Joshua? What did you say to your brother when you first saw him? Your your brother just got in the car. We just picked him up. He's coming over to do some stuff with us. And what did you say when you saw him? Uh, he looked what? Unrecognizable. Why does he look unrecognizable? Because he has a view going. <laughs> kind of looks like what? Uh. <gasps> oh boy. Okay. Is that your favorite song? That's a good song. Yeah, it is. I don't want to get copyright. We're going somewhere. We were invited somewhere. Super fun. Super cool for Joshua. Some place he's always wanted to go. And uh, the, the one thing about having autism for a lot of children are that they don't have friends, right? And that's always a difficulty, or that's something I hear from a lot of parents, because I do talk to quite a few parents on our Facebook group. And if you would like to join our Facebook group, that'll be in the description box below. So please feel free to come on over and join us. But um, a lot of parents have the difficulty of watching their children grow up and have birthday parties, just like we had last week. And you don't have children to invite for your child with autism. Friends for them to come and, and enjoy the party with them. So we just had an amazing um, shout out from Twitter. Uh, happy birthday to Joshua last week. And we've been continuously getting messages, cards. He's received some really cool things from all over. And um, he also received a jersey from Ford and Prep high school in New York from Chris Beyer who put all that together sent us a jersey for Joshua to have and to be like an honorary member on their team so he is officially a member of an ice hockey team he's never been a team member so that's very very cool so all these cool things have happened and in the midst of all that we ended up meeting a mother an autistic child who has severe autism. His name is David and something really neat happened with them. He asked her the first question in 21 years he's ever asked her, which was, believe it or not, will people like me? And that just, uh, that's amazing. It's kind of like I need to pause here for you to let that sink in because that's quite amazing to have a child who's nonverbal to actually ask that question would just be overwhelming and it was and she received a lot of response on Twitter from that and I was one of the people who responded to her and um, actually found out she lives right here right down the road for me and so her and I have been talking and have become very good friends and she invited us to go somewhere special with her son today so you're gonna see Say go. On your mark, 
Get set. Go. Go. He's ready. Go. I'm ready. I'm gonna cry. You're already thirsty, huh? We I gotta get it. Huh? Yeah. I need 30. Oh, wore out. Are you tired? Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. Really? You're pretty fast. I got to get Joshua on his toes. <laughs> Always on those toes. Yeah. Do you like that? That's a sensory like something's thing. Something's pushing me. <laughs> Is that what he said? What yeah. did he say? Something's pushing me. He's got two little fingers up. It's <laughs> awesome to your back. <laughs> Oh, yep, it's pushing you, huh? Oh, that's right. That's what mommy needs a massage. No, are they real fingers? Are they real fingers? Yeah, there's somebody hiding in there. <laughs> no, daddy's playing with you. <laughs> I want to see if I can find the access here. <laughs> find the person in there. Yeah, it's like not. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know it was going to do that. Do you like it or no? <laughs> Josh, was in the massaging chair. You like the massage? You he's ready for you to go with him. Okay, let's go. <laughs> you can't leave mom. <laughs> and there they go. Mom doesn't run down there. <laughs> That's <Yeah>. true. <laughs> Neither does this mom. You, you're you're now designated. You're the designated walker. <laughs> did you have fun jumping with David? Yeah. What else did you do? Huh? I went to the massage chair. You did the massage chair? So you're all done, right? You get your shoes on, you tell Miss Kate. We have something for them in the car. You get your shoes on, I'm gonna walk out with them, okay? Just a minute. Where did you go? Just throwing something away. You don't run away like that. It's really hard being the parent to a child with autism. It's very hard. It's a lot harder, it was a lot harder for us when Joshua was younger and was more severe. Um, he had... Thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching our channel. Thank you for subscribing to our channel. I thank you guys so much. It means the world to me. You, you have no idea how much it means to me. So I'm just saying maybe my talking about things that I go through. Maybe um, some things I say at home. And at the same time, you guys, this is really important. You guys help me. Your conversations, your support, your comments help me tremendously.
a really hard year. I lost my dad back in May, and we didn't get, he didn't have the opportunity to get to know Joshua. I didn't know it at the time, but I found out when he was in the hospital that he loved Joshua, and he thought he was an amazing child, and thought he was so gifted, and he told me to do this channel, you need to do it, because it's so, this is for my dad, too, and you guys help with that when you comment, and you let me know that at least it's worth it a little bit, so thanks, I appreciate it, hope you like the video.